And yeah, I really want to see what this bear has. Uh oh, oh no. Oh, oh, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out! Oh my God, holy Jesus Christ! Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and welcome to the beautiful Among Trees. Today, we're gonna to be playing a new survival game that has come out uh, about a week ago now, and I haven't really had time to play it just yet, but I have been very excited about it because, well, look at it. It is absolutely beautiful. Uh, and yeah, as the game would suggest, we're among trees, we're in the woods, and we have to simply survive. Um, so this game's currently in early access, um, but it is quite impressive looking. Uh, basically, in this one, we're literally just one with nature. We have to survive, you know, deadly predators like bears and whatnot, hunt, and build what I think is a cabin right here. So we're going to start off by doing that. Uh, we have to repair the cabin with fur planks and sticks. And yeah, it's a survival game, so we're going to uh, explore a little bit, and it looks like we got some beets there. And yeah, do our best to survive in this uh, unknown environment. So yeah, I'm really excited about this one. Like I said, it's early access, so um, I don't know if you guys would like this or not, so let me know in the comments below. Hit that like button. If you guys want to see more of this, let me know. And uh, yeah, we're going to see how far we can get today, and I hope you guys are enjoying it, because uh, it looks fantastic, and I'm excited to get back into a survival game. I really do like survival games quite a bit, and uh, this one's looking really, really good. Oh, looks like I've spotted my first animal. Now, I don't know if um, I can simply catch this guy, but uh, ladies gotta eat. We are female in this game, by the way. Um, let me actually check. Do we have anything just yet? Looks like we just have an outfit in our backpack. What? Well, the bunny is gone. You, you look away for a second, and he's long gone. What the hell is this? Oh man, that's one thing I love about survival games is simply exploring. It looks like we got some sort of rundown settlement of some sort over here. Can I loot these? I need an axe. Okay. And a lockpick to open up that. Well, we found this at least. We're not too far away from my house. Ooh, what is this? Looks like it's just a bunch of stuff. Turnip seeds, steel wire. Okay, this is great. Uh, this is obviously going to be a great loot zone. I need one more for a plank. Looks like I just got that. And we're getting into the metal already. So yeah, I have no idea how in-depth this game gets in terms of crafting, but just ju judging by what we're finding right now, I'm getting pretty excited. Seeds, so there's gotta be um, farming, obviously. And well, we have no more space in the inventory, so it looks like we're gonna have to either upgrade our backpack or make some sort of storage back at our base. So we're gonna head back to the base now. Um, looks like I can still hold stuff. So is it weight-based? It says 12 slots. Oh, I guess they stack. All right, well, that makes sense. All right, so we should have everything I need to build this, and there we go. So we can sleep here, save, and perfect. That's what I do need is a storage solution. So um, I don't know if that's going to be... Wow, I mean, we built a lot really, really quickly, but I'm hoping later it'll be a little more in-depth than that. But I'm cool with, you know, simplistic building. Um, what is this? Oh, okay, so we basically add on to this. We have a cooking room, an attic, and a crafting room. What do I want to do first? I think I should get my vitals done first, so obviously the cooking room will probably be my goal here. If we can go find some bolts, that'll be great. Then again, I think we'll just try and loot as much as we can and build whatever we can first. We can probably build a storage attic pretty quickly. I think there was probably nails over there, so we're going to head back over there in a little bit. Um, I'm just going to store some of this stuff that I don't really need right now. Now, I do know the beets I have to cook, so um, we're not going to be able to do those just yet. Um, what is this? Save progress. Perfect. We'll save that real quick. Yeah, game saved. Wait until nighttime, and we have to wait until nighttime to sleep, I guess. Oh my god, I just... Everything about this game, in terms of visuals, is absolutely fantastic. So yeah, we can eat this for a little bit. Um, it's looking like food's gonna be relatively easy, hopefully. I like a survival game where you don't have to think about food all the time. It's actually kind of nice, where you can just explore and, um focus on building. So yeah, I'm gonna head back. I think that area was over here. We should be able to loot some more of it. Well, I found a river, and where there's river, there's usually animals. Oh my god. Um, clearly the sun's going down. Gonna have to worry about getting home soon. I think we can fish in this game. Can we swim? Oh yeah, of course we can. Now can we dive? I don't really know how, and I don't know if there's any deadly predators here. It'd be really weird to be attacked by, like, a crocodile in such a peaceful game, but... I don't know yet, so I'm not going to take any chances here, but I just want to see if there's fish. Now, I already ate one of these, but I noticed when I ate it that it has a chance of poisoning me. So, <laughs> I think we got to wait to cook that one. I took the risk unintentionally, and I didn't die. Ooh, driftwood. Okay, we'll take that. All right, yeah, you know what? I'm going to need to start going home. 
Sun's going down. I don't know how dark this game gets, but um, it was a good first day. We did a lot of looting, obviously. Explored a little bit. I'm gonna go over. I'm gonna, probably gonna follow this r river tomorrow. There's gotta be something on the river. Unfortunately, my storage is rather lacking as well, so maybe I'm looting a little too much right now, but um, I don't know what's good and what's bad yet, so we'll just have to uh, deal with the inventory when it comes upon us. All right. First day, let's uh, have a little nap here, and hopefully we don't get attacked at night. That's always scary, but uh, oh my god, this game is just so peaceful. Day two, here we go. Would you look at that? Following the river was clearly a good idea, because we got another one of those zones, it looks like, up here. And that's where I got a, lo a lot of my steel and whatnot, so obviously... Oh man, can I get up there, though? If we follow this, there should be a w way up. Hey, there's a bird. Running too lo long will burn more energy. Okay, I'm just more curious about the bird. So there's gotta be hunting. I mean, I'm seeing all these wild animals. Okay, well, here's another tower. And yeah, it looks like we got some more loot over here. So it's nice to know that these things are probably gonna be all around the map. They're easy to spot, which is good. And that's where we get a lot of the real good stuff. Is that moss? Okay, I'm pretty sure this has gotta be moss. Yeah, stump moss. What do you know? Stump moss is on stumps. All right, at least I found some. I know where to get it now. Once we get one more of those, I think that's all we need. So I'm kind of just slowly wrapping around. Crouch. Wait. Dangerous animals. What? Where? Oh, God. I didn't even know, game. Thanks for letting me know. Um. Hello? Oh, the whole atmosphere has changed. We have creepy music now. I want. I just want to see it. Uh, the loading screen let me know that bears, although dangerous, usually have really good items around them. They're kind of like the dragons of this game, <laughs> where they guard the loot. So, um... Oh, Jesus! Oh my god, that's horrifying! <gasps> oh my god. Okay, so I know there's, like, stealth mechanics in this game, and yeah, I really want to see what this bear has. Uh-oh, oh no. Oh, oh, I'm out! I'm out! I'm out! Oh my god! Holy Jesus Christ! Oh, this game is not peaceful anymore! I'm bleeding. I'm out. I'm so sorry, bear. Oh, of course. You have loot here, but I can't really stay here now. What, what do I do about the bleeding? Well, that got real quick. Clearly don't screw with the bears. I thought I could sneak around it. I got a little confident. You don't screw with bears, damn it. Now, am I still, like, am I slowly bleeding? I don't know if any of these things... Um, spitter. I was hoping maybe we can patch with this. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get patches. We're going to have to make that crafting room quick, I think. Okay, yeah, I am still, unfortunately, bleeding. I wonder if it will stop? I haven't found any sort of medicinal items, I don't think. Oh, man, this royally sucks. I already have that, already have that. That's a mushroom. There's nothing I can do. Now, what do I need to make this? Steel wire. I need one more freaking moss. I wonder if I get lucky and find one around here. <gasps> oh, my God! Are you serious? This is amazing. Okay, please tell me I can make a, something to heal myself. I wonder if food will heal me. Um, I don't have time to look right now. Let's just build that crafting thing as quickly as possible. Okay, okay, okay. What else do I need? Um, fur planks. I should hopefully have enough of those, please. Oh, you best! This is, this is, this is just, this is like every survival game I've ever had. Man, I'm, I'm rapidly losing health now. All right, it's, <laughs> it just went down so rapidly. God damn it. Oh, well, that's convenient. Where? Oh, I, I, I didn't save, did I? <laughs> I don't think I saved. Wait, maybe I did. I think I saved that early at the start. Yes, okay. Well, at least we're back at this area, so um, I'm going to go out again. I don't think I really have much of... Well, yeah, we, we're kind of back to where we were, honestly, aside from the one bear trip where I died. So, uh, yeah, now we know. When the game warns me to crouch, freaking crouch, you idiot. And don't screw with bears, so... Oh, thank God there's a save system, though. All right, so yeah, I'm gonna get back out. I'm gonna go this way this time. And, uh, this time, hopefully I don't die. But, uh, I, I just got so cocky, I felt like you can't die in this game. It's too damn peaceful. No, of course you can. W watch out for bears, man. Okay, another day. Unfortunately, I didn't find much metal today, but what I did find is a lot of food, so I don't need to worry about the cookery so much. Uh, I think we actually should be okay. Um, so, I don't know... I mean, the cooking room... Problem is these fur planks, actually, surprisingly. Um, I didn't notice, but the attic needs 28. 
I don't find fur planks unless it's at one of those uh, big areas, at least from what I've seen. So I think this is a, something I could definitely do, and getting the crafting room makes sense. Do I have the steel wire? I forget if I looted that or not. So I have enough steel wire. I now have enough fur moss. I just need nine more planks. So hopefully we can find that today. Uh, regardless, we're going to go out there. I think I'm going to go back to kind of where we got attacked by the bear. I know that sounds like a dumb idea, but I know there's loot there too. And if we go there early, the bear wasn't there. So hopefully... I can get it in time. Problem is, I'm not the best at directions, and I thought I went to the same part of the river, and I'm definitely not at the same part of the river, so I don't know if it's this way or that way. I'm gonna go this way, because it's more pretty. Hey, I've trapped the bunny. I've trapped the bunny. Give me... Bunny! Aw, you can't grab the bunnies? I mean, you're kind of cute, little buddy. I don't want to eat you anyways. I'm, I think I'm doing fine with the mushrooms. I was hoping I could trap them in corners, though. That's good, I found one. Oh, 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 god damn it. Oh, why? Well, now I'm really debating going over there. I don't know, I don't know their patrols. Do they stay at home all day? Do they go out? He's coming back. Yeah, he's just patrolling it. Like, how am I supposed to deal with that? Please just keep walking, buddy. No, he stops. I am not gonna risk it this time. We know what happens. And, oh, great, I'm, I'm right by bees. That's like the last place you should be when, <laughs> when, when a bear is around. <gasps> Ooh, okay, that was clearly something that we needed. Um, pickaxe. It's now available for crafting. If only I had a crafting bench, that would that would be great. I got a lock pick and a pickaxe now that I can't use. Oh, that's a little frustrating, but hey, I, I mean, I understand. Gotta gather before we can craft, right? So let's just go through this creepy area. Hopefully there's no bears over here. Hey, is that a box? All right, usually these things are around those uh, towers. Be great if I could get my freaking axe. Oh, yeah. Oh, is there no bear? Let's go before there is a bear. Woo! Okay, finally got one. And we're gonna take everything we can. First of all, though, let's grab the planks, because that's the first thing we need. Is that a blueprint again? God damn! What is this? Water can? Okay, well, the more blueprints we have now, the better. That, that's good. I need planks, though. Just give me more planks. Can't believe I'm saying that in a game. Usually, wood's the easy thing to get. Oh my god, another blueprint. What is this? Tent? Ooh, so I was I was thinking, like, can I move my shelter? Because this world is freaking huge. Um, and clearly it looks like we can camp out, too. Uh, obviously, once we get the crafting bench. Which I, um... How many did I get? I have six. I, I think I have three at home, so I need three more, of course. I'm really hoping we can get lucky on the way home and find another structure. One that doesn't have a bear around it. But, uh, we might need to sneak, sneak by that bear as well, if I remember exactly wh where that is. <gasps> what the hell? How did I miss? Th these must reset, or is this a new area? I went back to what I thought was the original one I did. It's gotta be, because I don't have those, um, things I can loot. Um, I just have rope and everything. Actually, do I have room for rope? Yeah, I do. Sweet. Okay, well, it looks like we have everything we need for the crafting bench. Good thing I came back here. I was thinking, you know, there can't be anything there. But, there is! There's always loot that you miss. Um, yeah, this is clearly the one I looted, too. Is there anything else back there? I was wondering if there's, like, snow biomes, or if it's just nighttime. It looks like it gets a little chilly at nighttime. So, yeah, we're gonna get inside, obviously. And, um, yeah, we should be able to build this thing. Okay, just need the moss, and we are ready to rock and roll. So, crafting room, here we go. Got it! And, just like that... I want to see this in the morning time. Let's make sure we're all good. I'm very tired now, so let's go to sleep. We'll check that out in the morning and see if we can make any of the lock picks or anything. <sighs> okay, so is there anything, any storage in here? It'd be nice to get some more storage, that's for damn sure. Craft items, so what do we have? Resources, so I can turn other resources into better resources, so that's cool. This is all the stuff that we can get, so it looks like I'm still missing some blueprints. Uh, fishing pole, clearly. Looks like I... Can probably make lockpicks. I think I have some nails in the inventory, but I think we gotta focus on axes and other things first. How much is the tent? That is actually something that we might want to make. I really would like to get the fire. Unfortunately, we didn't get lucky and get that yet. Um, med kit, old regs. Okay, we'll definitely make some of those. And these are all just decorations, so obviously we'll focus on the tools right now, but it's nice to see that we got a bunch of different stuff in here. This is such a cool game. Um, okay, so what do I... I really should get the Woodsman Axe, so if I can get one more bolt, we are golden. Um, and I have the steel pipes to do that. Let me just make sure I don't have a bolt in the inventory over here. I don't think I do. 
No. All right, so we are going to make that woodman's axe. All right, so we'll craft that. There we go. Oh, I gotta actually grab it. That's cute. Um, and now, get the woodsman's axe. Oh, I feel like I'm finally getting somewhere. Hell yeah, dude. Now, I hope these things don't deplenish, because that's a lot of resources right there. Is there anything else I really want to get right now? I'd like the lockpick, because we can use the woodman axe and the lockpick at those areas that we found. Unfortunately, I need steel pipe nails and bolts for that. I don't think I have the resources to do that. So, the only other thing I could really want is a tent. And that's something I think we might actually be able to make. So, let's grab one of those. Actually, I, I haven't been picking up sticks, because I didn't think I was going to need any. Um, they're everywhere, though. So, I have the ropes needed. Tomorrow, we'll have to just pick up some sticks along the way today. And hopefully, we can make those. Alright, but I'm curious. Can I cut trees down, too? Or is it just, um... Oh my god, I can. Okay, cool. I really hope this thing doesn't dim diminish, though. Am I am I cutting this? It's hard to tell. Yeah, okay, so it kind of goes inwards. It's a little confusing. But, there we go. Oh, not out of my house! Oh, it's a good thing it doesn't break the house. Oh, and there we go. We can get fur planks now. Oh, thank God. Oh, that's so great. I'm just going to leave those there because inventory is a thing, and I don't want to deal with it right now. going to go back and whack those boxes, see what's in those. Um, because obviously that's kind of why I made this axe. I didn't realize, I didn't think I could honestly, um, cut trees down in this game, but clearly I can. Old rags. Okay, so it looks like it's just more randomized loot inside these, which is great. Um, hopefully I can get lucky. Yeah, that's what we need. Metal. Lots of metal. If only I had the lockpick now. That's why I want to get the lockpick next, because that's the one thing I can't do at these areas now. Okay, and I want to apologize, guys. I didn't even notice until now, but when the bear attacked me and I died, the game changed to super widescreen mode, and, um, well, some of you probably noticed. The only thing you really missed was the sun indicator and my, uh, food indicator on the far right, so, uh, I'm gonna keep this recording, because you really aren't missing much when that happened. I just want to apologize that that happened, and, um... You missed the side of the screen. Um, so yeah, now we know when we die, um, <laughs> we have to reset the resolution again. Oh, I see a box! I like seeing boxes. Those are always fun. Did I miss... Where are all these... Where, where's the giant tower? Does this one not have one? Alright, map hint. Large trees map hint found. Craft a map to view hint. Oh, there's maps in this game too? Jesus Christ. Okay, I've been living without a map. I'm jealous now. So yeah, it looks like there's not always the giant structure around these. I've been looking for the structures, not really looking at the ground, so I wonder how much stuff I've missed. Um, yeah, at least we got another one here. And I'm just gonna... Maybe I should grab the rope. Problem is, my inventory, as you can see, is quite filled, so I didn't want to grab too much. Oh, shoot! That's the wrong mushroom! I was supposed to eat this one. Okay, well, I have a lot of things to heal me. We, we, we have to get home. Oh, damn it, man. Damn it, I really should have got... Does the med kit heal me? Oh, why did I do that? Of course, 25%, and it affects me. Look at how fast this is going down. Oh, my God. I'm going to have to get home. Um, Please be a med kit in here somewhere. We're going to have to run home. I am far away from home, guys. This royally sucks. Benefit being, I saved just before this, so worst case, you know, that happens, but... It's just frustrating, man. These mushrooms look too similar, and I was rushing, clearly, and I shouldn't be rushing. Wait, these don't heal me? Oh, that's friggin' temperature! I'm dead. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm so dead. Unless I get lucky and eat more of these poison things, and I hope maybe the poison goes away? I don't know. I have to get home. I can't, I can't, I can't even loot the rest, because I feel like maybe the med kit will help me with poison. That's, that's my only saving grace. I mean, it's not like it was intentional, though, but it's still frustrating when you screw up. Ah, please slow down, Poison. It seems to be slowing down. I mean, I might get lucky. I'm looking for anything that heals me along the way. I'm not seeing anything. What the hell's that? Oh, I don't even, I don't even want to know. You know what? I, I have to do it, just out of curiosity. Fishing rod. The one there! Oh, God damn it! I really wanted a fishing rod, too. I love fishing. Ah, oh, well, maybe it stays there. I'm, I'm definitely going to die, guys. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I tried. Jump! Okay, well, at least we know there's no fall damage. And goodbye, everybody. Goodbye, cruel world. It's been nice knowing you. And at least we can load last save. All right, and yeah, we really didn't lose much on that. Um, I still got all the good stuff that we got today. It's just unfortunate that I, I died because I don't want to die. It's a survival game after all. But um, yeah, we clearly learned that although nature may be beautiful, 
it's a dangerous beast out there, and um, don't eat the mushrooms, unless you know they're good for you. <laughs> So yeah, we're gonna wrap up this episode of Among Trees here, guys. Let me know what you guys think of this, because I think it's just such a great little peaceful game. I'm excited to see um, the the, the add-ons of this and how much more we can add on. Is this it, or is there gonna be more rooms that are added on to these rooms? I'm gonna need a cookery soon, because I am slowly running out of food, so I, we have to try and get that next. Um, benefit being, we have the crafting station now, so bolts shouldn't be too much of an issue. And if we can, you know, have a safe day and actually get some loot done, uh, I think we should be able to get that done in the next episode for sure. And hopefully we can find that fishing pole, because I would love to fish. And, uh, yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying this one. So feel free to hit that like button. Let me know what you guys think of this. And as always, guys, thanks for watching and liking. I'll see you in the next one.